Hello, I'm Fantastic and Fantastic, and today I'm going to be doing a bunch of roles in the Hunter x Hunter collab, because the previous time it came around, I did essentially zero roles. So, there's lots of chances to get exciting stuff, potentially, or at the same time, to at least collect them all, so to speak. So, as a whole, I feel like this event has obviously some wonderfully desirable chase cards, but at the bottom rarity, I'm not that excited for. Furthermore, we don't have a, like, mass trade option. Like, Valentine's, we could dump a bunch into Noah. Whereas here, we have no, like, excess dump option. So, rolling and hitting bottom rarity is going to obviously feel more painful. But, mostly because I feel like their weapon assists are just not that great. Like, sure, it's nice, maybe in niche situations, but not too many I'm that excited for. So, with that being said, I'm still going to roll a bunch because, you know, haven't rolled really before. Because if I take a look here... I have one guy. Maybe, like, one or two things are a weapon assist. But, like, I've done, like, virtually zero rolls. So, here we go. I have one Valentine's event roll from before. We'll get this one out of the way. If it's a diamond, possibly exciting. If it glows, never mind. We'll just put you back into the possible machine or Noah fodder. Either way, Hunter x Hunter. So, if you play a bunch of du different dungeons, you get a ton of different free rolls. And I think everything's a diamond. And it didn't glow excitedly for myself, but it's new, like... Again, I've never acquired most of these cards. Bottom rarity, it's another possible option for full blinders. This It does give a bunch of RCV. I'm probably just going to keep it as that, to be honest. I guess if you're really desperate for, like, a system of these poison orbs for, like, you know, your cat girl and king of ants, maybe... They're all diamond. Wait, what? That's not diamond. And hello, Venus boy. Welcome back to the stream. How are you doing today? Is he a rare machine card? He doesn't look it. He looks very weak. So maybe it's a... I am so confused. Yeah, these are silver eggs. I don't know what these are. <laughs> I have no idea. It's just all my free rolls. I have no idea what they are. I guess so we're allowed to, like, own some of the cards from the franchise, I guess. Oh, I got this guy last year. I, in my head, he was, like, the imposter. Oh, well. No idea what that was. Bonus egg machine. Okay. No idea. Alrighty, Memorial Egg Machine. There's a chance. Wait, is that the word for 5 pull? I haven't done the 5 pull yet, so... Oh my fish! Seriously? I have like zero cards from this event. And you give me the same one twice? Two for two? Go fish yourself. Oh, what the fish? And Light Mirror. Oh, there's a ranking dungeon? Oh no, I haven't done it yet. Maybe I should look into it. After this. Glowing is a good sign. Like I said, I have like only two or three unique cards in this event. So virtually everything is going to be new. He's from last time around. But he's got a significant amount of absorption. And 7x6 fixing and delaying. And with more things giving 7x6 or 5x4 board penalties, this can be a nice solution for it. He does meaningful damage. I don't know what Super Awakening he has, but... Maybe skill boost plus? Not a bad weapon either if you need skill by resist. Yeah, I'm happy with this. Excellent. More absorption options is always good. And Osred, I only just started going through my free rolls because I only just started rolling. Tig is enjoying this ranking dungeon. I should get on it. And bottom rarity, unfortunately. But free rolls, I just assume it's never going to be that great. Well, Lightmere, you can give me some ideas of what I should do for the ranking, if, unless it's, like, fixed team. Or is it not fixed team? Cool. Like, I don't know what i do with these bottom rarities, and there's no dump for it. Okay, we're going to do some stone rolls, because I actually have very few cards in this event, so most things should be new. Five diamonds? Of course they're all diamond. If they glow, I get more excited. But it's still new. I've only got a single copy. 
That's a very, very long cooldown. That's unfortunate. That's just some resists. Oh well. Oh, that guy! He's like the only guy I had from last time around, basically. This is a good sign. Kite, I believe, if I'm not mistaken. Kite with his many random changing things. So confused. Be a pain to figure out what they do. Got some crazy slots. Those are a pretty nice spread of awakenings if you think about it. Bunch of killers. VDP. And a devil. A 10 combo. Almost a blind resist. If this is blind resist, I'd be so excited. But still, not a bad option by any means. Very happy. Oh, duplicate. Go away. Oh, yes! New is new. I have no idea who you are. You are new, though. Like, from not the. You're from this time around, if I'm not mistaken. Shaunark. A bunch of light damage. Hey, at least it's only a two turn cooldown. That's a lot. Of, it doesn't make hard orbs, though. That's definitely a bit of a drawback. Shaunark sucks, the shadow. No, don't say that. I got him. It's a three turn delay of two skill boosts. Healing, balance, killer. He also doesn't have any damage cap increase, which is definitely awkward. That's unfortunate. Let's try again. Done. Dead to done. Carbine is good for Muchiro and Pitu. Alrighty. I got a duplicate of a top rarity. Cat girl? Cat girl? That's my dream, is getting her. Maybe two of her. I have no idea who you are. I can't pronounce that either. Holy fish. Okay. Delays, transforms. That's a ton of 10 combos when you think about it. And he does get a damage cap increase, so he can realistically hit his damage cap. Wait, cat girl's a cat guy? Really? Oh my goodness. I've been deceived? Cat to a T? You would know. Really? Have I been deceived? I don't have it. I have no idea about this franchise. You know, it's an absorption cancellation with a ton of damage. Not a bad thing overall. A bunch of killers. Not bad. I don't understand what this thing is. Something new! Something high rarity! Really? It's actually a cat dude? Get out of here, no way. I have a guy who has interesting transformation steps. Woo! Transform. And then transform. And then transform again after like this one punch. So let's go through what it does. It's a delay and skyfall buff. One turn delay skyfall buff. One turn cooldown for big damage. But his damage cap doesn't get increased. I like the idea, but I don't know where I would utilize it. Also, VDP and TPA mixing, I don't not a big fan of. Two turn haste, four turn damage absorption, it's okay. But in terms of like Ranking dungeon, as Blue Nightmare mentioned, it's great because it brings a bunch of un different style bonuses. A bunch of different style bonuses, which is nice. Something new! Who knows? Maybe it's Cat Guy! It's the Cat Guy! <laughs> so wait, it's actually a guy, not a girl? Oh my goodness, great. Wait, I have a duplicate 7 star, and it wasn't the first ones... Is this one that duplicated it? Is this the one that's actually too qu quantity? Cat dude. Can you imagine if there's two of them? It was Asaka, or the, uh, the red guy, I'm pretty sure. Cat guy. 
Okay, well, Cat Guy is one of the strongest leaders available because System gives you attack and RCV buffs. It does big damage. It has enhanced hard orb, so it heals a ton plus the RCV buff. It gives attack RCV buffing. Damage cap increase two turns. Board change. Huge leader is fixed movement time, so you're immune to time debuffs, you're immune to attack and RCV debuffs. A lot of the nonsense that's being thrown at us more recently is completely dealt with, which is huge. Wait, I have this guy from before? Oh, I do have this guy from before. Oh, yeah, I have him as a weapon assist. Double attack while below. Pretty cool. Pretty cool. Either way, pretty great overall. Ah, oh, I think I'll do one more, because I still have lots of new stuff to get, I feel. Hopefully I get on my main account as well, too. It'd be nice, so I don't have to run just two amp people. Ah, duplicates. Osric, people have been telling me it's not a cat girl. Frankenstein? Franklin. Eh, like, you're gonna be made to a weapon assist. I don't know if I'd ever, like, realistically use them, is the thing. That's probably why I'm not a huge fan of, like, the bottom rarity. I got a second one of these guys. I guess I'll have them in each form. Well, one more five pull. There should be many new things. Like I said, I barely rolled this in the past. Two high rarity duplicates, but that could be two pieces of happiness. If it's cat individual. Thinks. I thinks you're gonna become a weapon assist. We got them all, ladies and gentlemen. Fantastic is truly fantastic. What do I do now? I can just trade for the top, the King of Ants if I really want. That was only how many stones? Was that only like... Was that three five pulls only? That was only three... No, that was four five pulls. I need Krolo. Do I have that? It's possible things are sitting in weaponous. No, I don't have that. Light Miru, I should do ranking. You're right. Is there anything I should do to like, score higher? I know SGB Haku, it is fantastic. So. Oh yeah, I do have one of these. Oh, I have this in a weapon assist. Why is Fantastic so good at this game? Amazing. Okay, well, I've got most of the stuff now, I feel. I have a bunch of these guys. You know, this is actually a system at three turns. This is actually not bad. Just, uh, it's another system. Not very good, but it's another system. He technically does large amounts of damage with double bricks and double seven. Maybe. Osmer says it could be cat guy or cat girl. Hmm. Like, if I take a look at monster change, this is good. This will determine. So I'm missing all of these things. Well, I have one copy of this guy. But I'm missing all of these things. I do have the king guy down here. I have most stuff when I think about it. Do I really want to roll for this girl? She is a good cleric though. I like the utility it brings. This one I can exchange for if I really wanted. One turn returns.
Yeah. I am thinking. And I will take a look at their soon Miru. I wonder if I could build the team. It sounds like it's not... Well, it's not fixed, I mean. Yeah, I feel like I've got most of the good stuff, I feel. Like, realistically speaking. Wow, look at all that. Wow. Mm -hmm. Okay. Like, I think I'm pretty good on this account. Like, I can trade for him. So I'm good. I do have... I'm missing, like, half the cards. Maybe one more five pull. Because... It's five pull. And I'm missing so many things. Like, I do have, like, the better cards, so to speak. But it's only 35 stones. I did all my monthly quests. Like, I, if I'm missing this many, it's still worth it, right? Look at all those duplicates. Well, everything's a duplicate still. But more of him. So now I've got two of him. Two of you. Well, I guess I don't have to decide which form I want. I can have it all. This is a nice absorption solution. Again, I know, right? Ah, like... I feel like the game is giving me good stuff, so it's like, I'm still doing well. I've gotten four of her, considering I'd never owned her before. And two Franklins. Fine, one more, because I technically didn't get anything new, and then I should stop on Fantastic. One duplicate seven star, but the chance of new ones. New is new! That is the girl I kind of wanted at the bottom rare, to be honest. Like, she's a strong cleric option, like I said. Four L's is going to put back all your assists. Crosses, get rid of sticky blinds. She heals. She also has a six turn cooldown. It's nice. Even one turn delay is sometimes, like... I've had instances where, like, stuff randomly has a delay, and it's pretty wonderful. And thank you for the beautiful bits, Ivan. More cat! Individuals! I've got enough. <laughs> what the fish? Can I have one on my other account now? Wait, I have until Wednesday, Lightmere? Oh, goody. Then I will definitely try more. Yeah, I'm happy, I think. Like, I, I feel like, what, like I got the cleric I wanted at the bottom. Like, I honestly got the cleric I wanted at the bottom. No, Tig, I want cats in my other account. Okay, I think I am going to stop on Fantastic. I'm going to play with the cats later, but I also may try the ranking dungeon too. Well, three cats on Fantastic. Still very little diversity, but, you know, if I'm going to get three of something, it might as well be three of the cat. Alrighty. So, let's do it again. On my other main account. Glow is not... Okay, I've got a bunch of this girl again. Gosh darn. Are any of the novelties worth it? Kind of like Final Fantasy where they have the giant button active. Ozra, I never have to worry... Seriously? Both accounts get this twice? What the fish? <laughs> Two in a row. Like I said, this account, same idea. Before I start, this is all I really have. And I only just got this girl now. Diversity is not my... Like, I have very few cards so far. So I'm looking forward to getting new stuff. I'm looking forward to getting new stuff. I think this is the thing that tricked me last time. Are any of these not- are these just like cards, things from the franchise? I 
I'm guessing I got that from last time. Are these just like characters from the franchise? Probably are. Probably like not important characters. Glow! Diversity! Well, it's the start of the swipe thing. It's from the old designs? Okay. Wait, that's for special condition TIG? Really? Come on. Glow. Glowing is exciting. Meow. I want to say meow. Ah. Something new. You know. What a bunch of nice utility. And damage. Like 210 combos with levitate should do a reasonable amount of damage. He solves so many problems with movement time and RCV. All these resists. Oh, the L. Like, it's a lot of, like, I counter a bunch of things. Counters so many things. You think he's the best role? Light Mirror Shadow is excited for it as well. It's like, I counter everything. Like. Oh, he also has a leader swap active. Oh, fish. <laughs> oh, so you're great utility and a real leader swap. Wow. Wow. Oh, this is way better than I thought. I just, I usually, I just skip the pre-transformed effect. Alrighty. It's like Christmas, well, it's like regular, like the Godfest exclusive Fasca, but with, you know, actual utility. That's huge. And damage. Wow. Wow. This is fantastic. No, this is mantastic, I should say. Wow. Alrighty. It's now time to roll. For real. I think it's like, isn't that like the seven star machine? Because that's the only seven star I got. That guy again, something new. I think it's from this time around at least. Two L's at least. I mean, two, four L's. Stuff. I got two of them, never mind. Oh, don't touch it! This game is great. Clearly this game is great. Me wow. It's a good start for my first five pull. Touch it. I know Hank. Touch it indeed. Wow. Go for me. Yes. You are new and exciting. Is this the guy for special conditions? Yes, it is. Krollo, this is the correct guy, for, isn't it? Wow, swap. One of the other swaps, but I got a better swap, I feel. Dungeon bonus, wild. Six OEs and two team HPs. This is a... Darkness fills my heart. I like dark things. Yeah, swap to cat, exactly. I've got the leader swapping things. Pretty exciting. And technically I could inherit something over top of it eventually. Look how dark this multi-pull is. Alrighty, let's do it again, ladies and gentlemen. That was fantastic. Streamer luck is real today. One duplicate. Maybe it's the cat individual. I should be getting a lot of new cards, to be fair, as well. I've barely rolled in this event. Alrighty, something a little different. At least I only have one copy. Good. I don't want more copies of that. Very long cooldown. Oh, well. Whoa, two of them! Two leader swap people! Well, I've seen people utilize doc this aspiring doctor for, like, the experience dungeon from this event. Because New Year's Nordis is a good solution in that dungeon. Wow. Now I have both weapon and base form. Yeah, like, he has also a shield plus auto-healing. 
So it's kind of like a bit of everything you want, so to speak. As a one-time use solution, it's strong. I agree, like it solves multiple things in one active skill. Yes. Let's do it again. I have so many things I can roll now. Two high rarity duplicates. Dang it. I should be getting new stuff though. Well, two of you and two of Well, Kite has actually a bunch of weapon assists. I already have one of his crazy slots from last time. So, I have some crazy weapon assist, maybe. Maybe, yes. Let's try it again. A no Skyfall water lead of damage is very hard to find. Really? Interesting, Light Mirror. That's good to know. That is good to know. Duplicate cat? No! Go away, person. Well, something new. Never mind, I got two of him. Okay, these are not so good rolls now. Not so great. There are still so many things I have not acquired. So many things. Let's try it again. Done. Da -da done. Oh, hopefully all new stuff? This is new, at least. I can't pronounce their name. It does... Wow. You just never have to worry about attribute absorption, basically. Interesting. Kind of weird. Guard break with two water combos. Kind of odd. I guess you are like a rainbowy water team. Mm -hmm. Something new! Good! I like new stuff. A nice attack while below 50% is always nice. There will be times where I want it. Three new high rarity cards is a pretty great vibe pull. Like, pretty great vibe pull. Fantastic got a bunch of these guys. It's an absorption thing with damage. Possible option. Okay, let's do one more. Ask your mom. There's several chase cards for sure. Oh, there's one duplicate top rarity. Hopefully new things. Oh, that's a very pain... Like, I have quite a few things I don't have, I feel. Ugh. Ugh. Well... I have to hand it to you, Haku. I'm gonna have this guy, I guess, twice. Ugh. That was not such a pleasant five pull. Okay, it's gone downhill for sure. No guns for sure. It's Well, at least gone I can trade for, Tig, so it's not as like, it'd be nice to get, because it says trade fodder. New is good. It's a nice cleric. I like this nice cleric. It's a nice cleric. I'll take it. Oh, I paid 35 stones for a nice cleric and yet another kite. I have three kites. Wow. Yeah, I've got a few of him now. Like, he does quite a bit of damage, doesn't he? 
Like, you only need three of them instead of, like, four before I forgot. Like, the animation's slow, but he should have high personal. They have a double seven and two bricks. And I think pretty high attack stat. Dirty one? I'm not sure. The thing is, when I play if it as a leader, I'll probably play if it as a leader for, like, a bit and then just switch to weapon assist is most likely what happens. Well, two duplicates at the end of high rarity stuff. Ah, this is not going well. How do I have five of these now? Like, how many have I done? I've done a lot more. I've rolled much more on this account. One, two, I've rolled basically all my stones, too. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight. I've rolled quite a bit. So I've got most of it. Just top rarity stuff I don't, I guess. I do have one more five pull. But then I won't get any more stones for a while now. But everyone says go all out. New is new. We'll try one more time. And that's all I can do, unfortunately. Come on, big money. So. Cat. Oh my gosh. Just dark things again. Well. I have too many kites now. I guess I have kites weapon assist in every form. <sighs> so random everything. Well, I can't save anymore. I only can save now. Oh well, still. At least I got one cat individual, so that's something. But I did roll maybe too much, I think, in this event. There's still a bunch of new stuff and new useful stuff, though. So, overall, I'm happy, I'd say. Fantastic, I think, crushed it pretty well. So, hopefully this video gives you some insight or inspiration as to what is possible in this event. There are definitely some strong things you can acquire. And if you did manage to roll, did it turn out well for yourself? So, hopefully all you lovely ladies and gentlemen have a truly fantastic day. I wish best of your own pad adventures and happy puzzling.